Tom McDonald, he's back and he's here on Reacts. <laughs> Welcome back. It's your pal Tommy Boy with another edition of Tommy Boy Reacts. And like you heard me just say, Tom McDonald is back. He's got a new single. This one is entitled America. And we are going to check it out right now. Uh, no sense uh, yapping on about it. Let's get right into it. And here we go. Lately, USA is getting scarier. Half of the Americans I see all hate America. They hate the cops doing their best to take care of us and kneel for the flag, insult the soldiers that we're burying. I'm tired of the pissing and complaining. Why you living in America if all you do is hate it? You think it's brave to take a stand against the nation? Real bravery is dying for the right so you can say it. Dear America, what happened to Americans? Apparently no one's aware or cares that it's embarrassing. It's arrogance. Our greatest enemy was always slavery and terrorists. And now it's people in the country trying to burn the heritage. I can't help it. I just seem to see the world different. It ain't Republicans or liberals. It's mental illness. The internet is only interested in left opinions. Cancel culture's got more power lately than the First Amendment. If you don't like it, leave. We will not defund police. We don't want no riots in our neighborhoods or in the streets. We respect freedom of speech. We protect what we believe. We don't want nobody dead, so please do not tread on me. And normally I'd, uh, I would have already chimed in with some more, but I'm just going to hang back and let Tom speak this message because so far I've got nothing to rebut against. I've got nothing to, uh, really nothing much else to say about it. Uh, so far, as I am usually most of, uh, actually, by, by most, I mean 99.99999% of what Tom has said in his videos, I'm lockstep right in there i absolutely agree and if the giant flag right behind me isn't enough of a dead giveaway hey you could always just uh read the shirt which yeah hang on let me get that out of the way yeah let me get in the picture there yeah that about tells you all you need to know about where I stand as far as this country. I'm not going to be one of the sheep. I'm going to be one of the lions. And I don't mean the Detroit lions. Yes, I am from Detroit, but I'm not going to be one of those lions. I'm going to be the ones that actually protect those from the people trying to destroy us. Anyway, I'm going to get, get off my soapbox. Shut up. Let's get back to it. In America... know what the hell happened to the patriots lately this nation is so ashamed and hating itself did everyone forget that people died to pay for this ungratefulness united states gave everything to you just to help i just want to celebrate thanksgiving with my family i don't need your help to understand it was a tragedy can i just be thankful for my country eating happily without you trying to kill me for the genocide and casualties I can't help it, I just seem to see the world different It ain't black or white, it's conflict designed by the system I don't need your pronouns, all I see is men and women Kids are taking pills for fun while people can't afford prescriptions If you don't like it, go, hate it, then don't call it home We don't need no violence, got no time for all you radicals Screw your status quo, we're not animals I won't kneel for the anthem cause the flag is what I'm standing for In America government and still love the country the fundamental values of america are concrete republicans and liberals are dumb to put it bluntly they're labels that they use to create chaos and corruption you can know the history and still be proud of where you're from every flag around the world is covered in a little blood we started out united states divided is what we've become if home is where the heart is you should show america some love in america you're free to make free in america that soldiers dying overseas so america
Tom does it again. He comes out with something that is absolute truth. Uh, the people wanting to destroy this country have a little bit too much uh, voice and power in this country right now. That should scare everybody. Not from a First or Second Amendment point of view, but from a nation as a whole point of view. That should scare the living daylights out of everybody. And it's sad that it takes a Canadian, of all people. No. To point all this out, you know, what kind of country have we become when a Canadian loves our country more than a lot of the people that live here? No, that should speak volumes to everybody. And quite frankly, if you're an American and you want to try to take away all these rights, you want to try to destroy everything because you think you're going to have it good on the other side with a fundamental change in this country, do everyone a favor, get the fuck out. Because you're not. You're not gonna be you're not gonna do better. You're not gonna fare better. You're gonna be one of those poor saps like what they have in Venezuela that actually wanted this stuff and then regretted it the second that it happened to them. Cause they thought, oh, maybe if I get on board with this, I'll be okay. They'll take care of me. You're fooling yourself. And quite frankly, you're just a fool. That being said. Tell me what you think down below in the comments. I'm sure you're going to tell me one way or the other anyway. And of course, as always, be sure to hit that subscribe button, click the notification bell, like and share. And we will see you next time on another edition of Tommy Boy Reacts. Keep it tight.